Hey everyone, hey dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ. So in looking through comments this morning, something caught my attention. Stephen says, any idea how I can watch Jeremiah Cohen's videos? His channel has been wiped. Beagle says, oh wow, I was watching his videos two days ago, and now it's completely empty of videos. Sustainable says, I think he explains why he removed his content in his channel description. Sure enough, if you go to his channel and go to his home, this channel has no content anymore. He, he does have some playlist stuff set up, but it's not his own content. It's other useful information. But if you go to the About Me, it says, and I take this to heart, brothers and sisters. So our brother Adam at Jeremiah Cohen channel has deleted his videos and says, Okay, so now you know of the darkness. Now focus on Jesus. Be aware of not obsessed. I border on being obsessed with this stuff. I know. I do it every day. And I, I'm, I'm taking a note from our brother Adam, who I very much care for. Uh, he says, The more you can be less obsessed by the presence of evil while resisting it, the better off you will be. Once you know there is no use diving endlessly down the rabbit hole, and it's just that. I don't knock anyone for doing this research and work, and I know, it can, I, know I can't talk someone away from doing it, and I won't. Everyone must make their own decisions. I lack confidence in some of my assertions, and I do not have time to figure out in which videos... Those who watched and get it, I would recommend putting all that emphasis on God and pointing the finger inside more than outside to make sure the Illuminati isn't in you. Well, I do find this stuff helpful. It's helped me, and I hope it helps you guys to get out of the world more and go towards Jesus more. I'm going to try and focus more on Jesus in my life and focus on Scripture and not be so obsessed with this. I, I love our brother Adam, and I'm going to take a note from him here. I understand what he's doing, sort of. I don't know what he's going through, and I pray that he's okay. And right, It sounds like he's getting more serious about getting back with the Lord and having a relationship with him, which is something we all need to do, right? We all get busy in this world, and this, like, I will say, like, I used to be into the reptilians and blah, 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 like a bunch of other stuff and, like, conspiracy stuff. And I, I was definitely down some rabbit holes. And there was times in my life where my mental health was definitely in question, where I was, you know, needing a break from things. And focusing on biblical earth, focusing on the Freemasons that do the, the plain to see, they're hidden in plain sight, but like the signs, symbols, and agendas, those are something I'm not like making up or it's not a conspiracy theory. You guys know this. And I, I, I've heard from comments that it does help some people. And this stuff has helped me. Adam's channel helped me to know a lot of the, a lot of the biblical world. And I'm grateful to him for his work. Um, it's, it's a shame that his, his work won't be there for some new people to see. Because I believe there's always new people to this. I did notice this the other day. Like, I am on Pinterest. It seems Adam has removed all of his Pinterest stuff too. Which is a shame. I wish he didn't do that. But... Xavier is someone else who does this. He, he, he has a YouTube channel. He hasn't been on for some time, but he's been doing this stuff more. He's been active on Pinterest. So it's kind of strange. Xavier came back and he's active on Pinterest. Adam's been a little active now, but he removed his content. Let's all pray for both of our brothers, Adam and Xavier. And, you know, let's pray that they're okay. Let's pray that they're keeping strong in the Lord, which I'm sure they are doing. They're good brothers. I love them very much. Brothers and sisters, so while it's a little surprising and I'm a little disappointed that Adam removed his content because he had good, good, he has good content, but I understand why he's doing this, right? Like these rabbit holes about the world, they go very deep and they're very complicated. Satan, he's a complicated mess. He's, a, he's the father of lies and lies are complicated. The truth is not complicated. The truth is up is up, down is down. God is correct. God is God. Like you guys know what I mean, I think, right? So again, let's pray for our brothers. Uh, I'm just bringing this to your attention because a lot of you found my channel by our brother Adam at Jeremiah Cohen channel recommending me and Xavier or like shining the light on us a little bit. And, right, we, we have sort of similar content. We, we show the signs, symbols, and agendas. I don't have much else to say. I'm just, uh, you know, again, I, I woke up this morning checking the, the comment section on YouTube. I'm going to continue to do my channel. I feel led to do it. I'm going to take note from Adam here and be less obsessed with it because I, I know I can border on that. That's for sure. And I've had some people say, focus your energy on positive things and whatever. And I'm going to do that as well. But I'm, I'm not going to, like, 
not focus on the signs, symbols, and agendas because I'm very passionate about it, right? And some people have said, oh, you've helped me, you've helped open my eyes, and I, I want to do this channel and balance it. I want to talk about the Lord, the promises of God, you know, the hopefully soon coming rapture. I know not everyone agrees about these things, right? We all take scripture a little differently, but, you know, I'm open to comment section. Some people comment very rude and that, that kind of stuff I don't really have time for. If you've been on YouTube and have a channel, you know that you can't take time for every single rude person on here because it gets you down and not everyone is correct. There's a lot of people that have ideas about things and it's not always correct. But people that come on here that are a brother or sister in Christ, or even if they're a lost person and they're polite about things, I will take time and try and like help them and we can help each other by having some comments and conversation back and forth. So I just wanted to bring this to everyone's attention. A lot of us have been missing Adam and Xavier, and I hope and pray they're okay. Maybe Adam will come back and have some different kind of content where he focuses on God and Jesus. And, and, and again, when I say God and Jesus, I'm like the, our Father and Jesus. I know Jesus is God very much. When I found out Jesus is God, it made me so happy because I'm like, you know, I know who God is. That, that's a huge step. That's something huge to realize. This is years ago now. There's some people that deny that Jesus is God, and I think that is incorrect. There's lots of scripture that point to Jesus being God. And he's One of his names is Emmanuel, God with us, right there. That's very, very obvious. So brothers and sisters, let's keep moving forward. Let's keep looking up for our redemption draws nigh. I myself will take a note from Adam and try and focus on the Lord more and give him more of my time. I'll get into the word more and just pray to him and not be so obsessed with doing these things. I still will do these videos, that's for sure. I feel led to do it and it helps me. This stuff has helped open my eyes, again, to make me step out of the world more, not to idolize celebrities and rock and roll musicians and blah, 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 blah. And it helped me to run to Jesus more and have confidence in my faith in Jesus. That's where my faith belongs. You listening, no matter who you are, you know where your faith belongs, 100% in Jesus Christ, his finished work on the cross, his death, burial, and resurrection, according to the scriptures, is the only way, the way, the truth, the life, the only way to be saved. Saved, only way to the Father, only way to heaven, only way for forgiveness. Jesus is the way. God bless you, everyone.